The reality is that sequestration not only undermines our national security, it will hurt our economy, and it could fundamentally tear our defense industrial base. And that is of deep concern, uh, not only to my membership on the Senate Armed Services Committee, but as a member of the Small Business Committee. Often with our essential weapons system, it's not just the large defense contractors that will certainly be impacted by the sequestration cuts, but they rely many times on very small contractors. And in some areas, there's one contractor, a small company who's producing the component where you have a sole supplier. And when these businesses go out of business or they decide to do something else because they cannot deal with the uncertainty of where we are right now or they cannot address uh, or keep their bottom line in a sustainable way uh, because of the cuts that are coming, they go out of business and they don't come back. And it's not easy for us to recreate that capacity so quickly if we suddenly find ourselves in a situation where we need that type of equipment, when we need that part. Uh, and that just doesn't happen overnight. And that's a deep concern, not only for our large defense contractors, but for many small businesses throughout this country that serve those uh, contractors.